So in this video we're going to go through how to tether with a Samsung Galaxy Note 2. So what that is, is using your mobile phone's internet connection to connect another device to the internet wirelessly without having to plug it in. So you've got to bear in mind, some networks nowadays don't actually cover it in your data plan. So you need to check with your network to see whether or not tethering is actually covered. Um, the option is normally available on the handset either way. So what we're going to do is we've just unlocked the handset and we need to set it up on the phone first. So go into the settings, so menu and then settings which is the little cog button as usual and then wireless networks we just click on more settings. Tethering and portable hotspot is the third setting down. So we'll click on that. And the option just to turn it on is literally just to click and it, it explains to you be enabling a portable Wi-Fi hotspot. So we'll click OK on that and then it's on. But you need to configure that if it's going to be the first time you've used it. So to actually get to the configuration you need to click just above where it says portable Wi-Fi hotspot. I actually click the words itself and it brings it up, it explains on what it is. So in the bottom right hand corner you just want to click configure. You can call your network whatever you want, Dave's phone for example. Under password here, I'm just going to click on show password. I'm just going to put password 1 as our example. And then we'll just click save. And that is it, we are then active, open and you can connect a laptop, anything like that up to it as you normally would. So. Just to use an example, I'm going to find the network on my Galaxy Note 10.1. So, menu, settings, Wi-Fi, and it's just scanning the local Wi-Fi's now. And I would click on Android password 1 and connect. And that is it. Um, so my tablet is now running through my phone essentially. And it is as simple as that. Obviously it works the same with laptops. You can contemporarily connect other mobile phones to it if you need to. So I hope that was helpful and thanks for watching.